What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with Hockey Sister Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Just saying. Um, I wasn't planning on doing this reading, but um, I got up about it's 2 a.m. Central Standard Time right now. I got up about approximately 1 a.m. to go pee. Just, just saying, bro, bro. And then um, I lay back down. I watched the reading of one of the guys on here. He's really good. And then I got up and then I got a channel message. So I decided, and then I got a couple more. So that was, you know, when the spiritual realm calls, spiritual realm calls. So I'm in here at 2 a.m. Central Standard Time I'm doing this. I just want to, disclaimer, um, they're not positive messages. I just want so if you feel that i mean some, sometimes there's sunshine and rainbows and sometimes they're not this is not sunshine and rainbows just letting everybody know okay um don't forget the basics time is fluid energy is fluid if it doesn't apply it apply everyone has free will only take the messages that resonate with you this is a free general reading happy black friday everybody Woo -hoo, woo -hoo. Okay, so um, the first one is a very significant motor vehicle accident is about to occur soon. Um, the person, for some, one person, for some people will end up in the ICU. Some will make it, some will not, is what I heard. So um, you plug it in, how that resonates. A very significant motor vehicle accident. Is about to occur soon. Um, it sounds like there's more than two very significant motor vehicle accidents about to occur in the universe, is what it sounds like from the message. Um, but I heard some people, um, one person, in some of these situations, one person's going to end up in the ICU. For people that don't know, ICU is intensive care unit. It's like the one step away from the pearly gates energy. Um, you're not in the ICU. Unless you were on death's dying de uh, door, and I'm just being for real, for real. Like, it is, it's called intensive care unit for a reason. Like, people are on vents up in the ICU. I mean, I'm just being for real, for real. Like, they, they are in very, very, very critical condition. You're not in the ICU unless you are in extreme critical condition. So, I just let everybody know if people don't know that, okay? But in some of these situations, one person's going to end up in the ICU from this very, it sounds like a very critical motor vehicle accident. Some, it's two or more. So um, you plug it in, how it resonates. My God Almighty. Drugs and alcohol there. Will be extreme problems with insurance company. It's going to start a huge investigation into the past. For at least one of these circumstances. Oh my God. Whoa. Okay. So, well, I'm assuming we're talking about the motor vehicle accidents. Um, there's at least two. It sounds like it's about to occur in the universe. But. I heard extreme drugs and alcohol there. So, um, and in at least one of those situations, there. Uh, well, it sounds like all the situations, if they, um, I'm thinking, if drugs and alcohol are involved, which if they, obviously they're going to end up in the friggin' hospital, some of these people in the ICU, um, intensive care unit, they will run blood work on them. They, I mean, that's standard when you go to the, the hospital, they run blood work on you, especially if you're, hold up in a freaking ICU, you know, you're not bad off. They will blood, run blood work. Well, the blood work will show alcohol, extreme alcohol levels and extreme drug levels, whatever drugs they're consuming. Um, but apparently they're going to want to be compensated, whoever these people are. Come here, baby. Come here. Hey, not at the outlet. Come here. Not at the outlet. Um, they're going to want to be uh, compensated. Hold on a second. My cat is scratching at the outlet. He never does that. Come here. Come here, baby. Come on. There you go. There you go. Yep. Good boy. Right here. Right here. 
Okay, I'm sorry. So um, they, they're going to want to be compensated. I guess reimbursed for their vehicle, reimbursed um, maybe the other people. If they, it sounds like they're probably the cause of the accident because uh, I heard extreme drugs and alcohol uh, is going to be a factor in this. So the other people is probably going to be compensated for their vehicle and blah, 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 blah. Well, I heard there's going to be extreme problems. So I'm in at least one of these situations, an extreme investigation. It sounds like the insurance company or some, or maybe the police or somebody else, but somebody, let me see if I hear, let me see if I hear, I, I don't know. I don't know if it's the insurance company. I don't know if it's the police. It's about to cause a huge hornet's nest. They caused you extreme chaos in the past, and they're about to get their karma. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. Okay, I heard he's about to cause an extreme hornet's nest. They caused you huge chaos in the past. They're about to get their karma. So they, so you play, whoever these people are in your life, if it resonates for you, it may resonate, it may not. You know, you only take the messages that resonate, but is what it's sounding like from this, you guys, is it's somebody you're connected to that's about to get into a huge motor vehicle accident. Now, whoever this is in your life, if it resonates, I'm just a channeler. Don't hurt the messenger. Just saying, okay? So, whoever this is, is what I'm saying, is somebody that has caused huge chaos in your life in the past, is what it sounded like for the messages. But I heard a huge hornet's nest is about to be open. I was hoping to hear if it was the police or the insurance company that's going to cause the huge investigation. Um, I didn't hear that. But I heard a huge hornet's nest is about to be open for them because they caused you extreme chaos in the past. So it sounds like it's negative karma about to cycle around for them. But they caused the negative karma to their own self. But I think they intentionally were karmics to you and blocked you in the past. But now they're paying for it in the universe because of their own actions is what it's sounding like. So, I don't know if it, I still am unclear if it's the insurance company. I feel for some of these situations, it will be the insurance company because I heard it's something, something that happened in the past is going to cause a huge investigation. In some cases, it could be police. Some, um, some, it could be some other, somebody else with a huge investigation. For some, it could be the insurance company, but I'm sure they're going to want to be compensated for the vehicle and the other person's going to be compensated, blah, blah, blah. But, when you get into an accident, which I've never, you know, I've never been under the influence of any drugs or alcohol while driving or otherwise. I mean, I don't do drugs and alcohol. I just don't. But I'm not saying I don't drink socially from time to time. I used to years ago, but I don't even drink socially now. Um, since I've been on the spiritual path and had an awakening and all that, I don't even drink socially. Because um, I don't associate with anybody to drink socially. <laughs> but it's better that way. It's better that way for me. It really is. Um, but my point is, is I think it might be the insurance company that's going to open up a huge investigation on at least one of these people. Um, I, I, because uh, maybe they false insurance claim in the past. For at least one. Oh my God. Ooh. False insurance claim in the past at least once. And a stolen inheritance is about to become very, very significant in one of these cases. Oh, my God. Okay. Oof, this is getting so juicy. Okay. So, false insurance claim has been filed for at least one of these cases in the past. So, I'm assuming yes. So, probably the insurance company will get involved for at least one. And a stolen inheritance has, is very significant in one of these as well. It might be the same one. It might be a different. You have to plug them in your life how they fit. Um, so, somebody is connected with some very shifty people, or you used to be. You're either still connected with them, or you used to be. I'll tell you that. How will that resonate? But somehow, you're about to, whoever these people are that caused you extreme chaos in the past, they're about, I mean, they're about, some of them about to end up in the hospital. And I just don't know how else to say that. I mean, I, I mean, I never thought I'd be here at 2 a.m. on 11, 26, 21 doing this, but I am. Um, but I, that's what it's sounding like, you guys. I mean, now, of course, you know, this might just be for one person in the universe. Okay. I know 
there I have um I have like eight point eight thousand subscribers right now. I think it's eight point eight. I know I keep it private on there, but I had some gang stalkers on my page and um um crazy people just basically just using my page to stalk me and steal my content crap that I had to um private my um subscribers. But I have like eight point eight thousand subscribers ish right now. Ish. Um, but it, it may just be for one person and it just may be for one person. Well, at least two people, at least two people. Cause at least two, but you plug it in, how it resonates. You plug it in, how it resonates. Oh my God. Um, but my point is, is you might, um, hear about this soon is what I'm saying. You might hear about it soon or you might hear about it through the grapevine. Um, I'm feeling you might hear about it. Um, for some, you may not hear about it. But this is huge. People ending up in the ICU is huge. I mean, that that's not like, oh, going to the ER and telling you to drink lots of water and get some sleep and hear some meds. No, no, nay, nay. ICU is way different, way different. Completely different ball game. Like I said, on freaking death's dying door. Um, oh, my God. Let me see if I hear anything else with this, and I'll tell you the other one. At least one person will pass away from this. Surprise person in the wheel. People connected, closely connected to this person that passes away will be very, very, very pissed. Very. Oh, my God. So you, oh, my God. So you plug it in. And there will be nothing they can do about it this time. They have manipulated the system in the past. Oh, my God. Ooh, we. Ooh. So you plug in how it resonates. So I heard at least one person is going to pass away from this. Um, the severe, uh, there's about to be a severe motor vehicle accident soon. I, I don't, like, I didn't hear specifics. I didn't hear times. I didn't hear days. Energy is fluid. Time and energy is fluid. So you have to plug this in however it resonates. But apparently one person that's going to pass away from this has a surprise person in their wheel. I'm thinking it's you. If this resonates with you, because I'm getting these channelings for a reason. I think it's you, but I heard they manipulated and abused the system in the past. So I think you were owed some kind of wheel or, in well, one of you guys was at least owed an inheritance, a stolen inheritance in the past. It got stolen from you. So it may be the same person. It may be a different one, but some, but it sounds like at least one of you guys is in the wheel for the person that's about to pass away. It sounds like they're coming to ICU and they don't make it is what it sounds like. From this motor vehicle accident. But. Um, you're, you're in the wheel. Uh, I think one of you guys is in the wheel. And you don't know you're in the wheel. For some of you guys. You might not have even communicated with this person for years. Um, and I'm just being straight up. I feel for some of you guys. You've blocked them off. I feel you've blocked them off. Maybe for some you still communicate with them. Or you communicate with people connected to them. But I don't feel you like. Obviously you're not going to be in the middle of this motor vehicle accident. I don't feel you are, is what I'm saying. So you're obviously not that close with them. Um, but um, it sounds like at least one of you guys is in the wheel, but you don't know you are. But people that I heard that are very closely connected to this person, so people they're right, hanging out with, shooting up drugs with, partying with, drinking up, doing whatever the hell they're doing, um, they're going to be pissed because they wanted to, I'm sure they wanted to be the person in the wheel because whoever this is, they have money. I'll tell you that. They have money. Um, and or property or assets or something, but they don't want you to have it. These other people don't want you to have it. The people that party or people or close family members or moochers or what have you, they don't want you to have it. But you're apparently in the wheel. And I heard they blocked you in the past. So these people or this person, maybe this person that has you in the wheel blocked you in the past 
but they had you secretly in a wheel in the wheel but i heard um basically there was abuse of power in the past so i think you were owed a wheel or an inheritance or something of this nature in the past but somebody manipulated the system and abused power and basically um probably doc um alter documentation or something of that nature to where you wasn't able to get your money or property or assets or something to try to leave you poor i'm pretty sure um but i heard it's not going to work this time it's not going to work this time so you plug it in however it resonates oh my god world all right let me see if, uh oh let me see if i hear anything else and i'll tell you the other one Okay, I didn't. I didn't. Oh my God, that's we are sixteen minutes in, but that's what I mean. I got many more challenges with it. Okay, so here's the other one. Here's the second one. Okay, so the other one was a Libra feminine forty. Ow! Ow! Hold on a second. Ow! Oh, come here! All you gotta do is come up here. Come here, baby. Oh my God, he tried to jump on me, but it was on my back. Come here. Okay. Oh, that hurts so bad, you guys. Oh my god. Okay. Um, okay, so the second one is a Libra Femme, 40 and above. Business is about to tank him to the ground, is what I heard. And then I heard some um some professional legal sector, some um some uh online astrological videos. Fake dark spiritualist um so you plug it in how it resonates um you plug it in how it resonates it's a libra feminine 40 and above and i heard that specifically from spirit 40 and above so you know i just didn't hear older if i hear older i kind of gray line it 35 to above because that is the great 35 to 40 is the great area in the growth but i did hear 40 and above so whoever this Libra is, it's a Libra feminine. So they have fem parts or fem and masculine. But I strongly feel it's somebody that just strictly has fem parts because they aren't fem. Or it could be, I, I'm thinking it's a strict fem. It may be a fem and masculine. You plug it in how it resonates. But I did hear feminine. So if they do have masculine parts, they act in their feminine energy. Um, but however that resonates and whoever they are connected into your life. But I heard their business is about to tank into the ground. So that, you know, you're doing well, you're doing well, you're doing well, or you're doing great, great, great. And then boom, it just goes down hugely. Um, I heard some of these are professional in the legal sector. So it's at least two Libra Femmes, 40 and above in the universe, whoever this resonates with. Some, they're professional in the legal sector. So I'm thinking possible paralegals or lawyer or a judge or bailiff or something that in the legal well bailiff would yeah that would be legal something in the legal sector they're professional in the legal sector they are 40 and above they have a business though they have a business so i'm i think i think lawyer i think a lawyer or a judge well judges don't i don't know judges don't hell they might have a side business i don't know Somehow they're in a, the legal sector and they have a business of their own. However, that resonates for whatever Libra Femmes 40 and above, I guess I should say. Because that's all I heard. And but that's when some Libra Femmes in the universe 40 and above where their business is about to tank down. Some, they, it's like yin and yang over here. The other Libra Femmes 40 and above, um, I heard they have, they're dark art spiritualists. So they practice on the dark art side. So that's black magic. That's coven energy. That's black magic. That's manipulation. That's sex magic, probably. Um, confusion spells, memory spells. I mean, the whole freaking nine yards, man. Um, but I heard they do um, astrological videos. They do astrological videos, apparently. Um, it sounds like online, on social media, in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, but their business is about to take down in a huge way. And I heard I heard specifically from Spirit, they are a dark, dark art spiritualist. But they do some kind of astrological videos online in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, 
I'm sure they do not tell the people that, you know, they do these astrological videos online. I'm sure they don't tell the people that consume and watch their videos because obviously they're gaining a lot of money off of it, um, that they, um, that they're a dark art spiritualist. I, I'm sure they probably don't because who's going to want to go to, uh, I mean, well, I don't know. Maybe some, some people like going to voodoo witch doctors and all that crap. I don't know. I didn't hear whether they do or don't. But it's a dark arts Libra, Fem, 40 and above, dark arts spiritualist. So whether she portrays to the world that she is a dark arts spiritualist or not, she is. And her business is about to tank down in a huge way. She does astrological videos, I'm presuming, online. So you plug that in, how that resonates, if that resonates. Oh, my God. Um, you plug it in, how it resonates. One particular water sign masculine is about to be very, very integral in these car accidents. And a water sign feminine. And an air sign. Oh my God. Okay. So I heard it. Okay. So we're back to the car accident. Accidents. Heard a particular water sign femme, water sign masculine, and an air sign. Air sign. So that could be masculine or femme. Um, is about to be very integral in the car accidents. So I'm thinking these might be the people in the car accidents in some shape, form, or fashion. Water sign masculine, water sign femme, air sign. So that could be masculine or femme, air sign. Uh, air signs are Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. They could have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and there's Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Mid, Hand, or Jupiter. Water sign masculine is Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. They could have Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio, and there's Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Mid, Hand, or Jupiter. Water sign femme. They could be. They could have Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio, and there's Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Mid, Hand, or Jupiter, and then the air sign: Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, masculine or feminine. Oh my goodness! Oh. Let me see if I, those are the those were channelings I got. We're 22 in, minutes in, but those were channelings I got. Let me see if I got anything else. I'm gonna go back to bed, man. I've been sleeping very peacefully. A particular Libra feminine 40 and above is about to start having severe memories and flashbacks of the past. It's about to mess with her mental health in a huge negative way and create very negative series of chain of events very soon for her. Possible self-harm. Drugs and alcohol are already there. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh. You plug, oh my God, this is so dark. This is so dark. You plug it in how it resonates. This is so dark. This is somebody I guess you're connected to, you guys. You have to plug these people in how you resonate, how they, how they resonate in your life. I don't feel it's you. I just want to say this. I don't feel these people are you. I just want to make that very clear. I don't feel these are y'all. I hope not. Um, they may, hell, they may be. Because I know I've had some crazy ass people stalking my pages for um my page for um my channel for a year and a half trying to prevent my sub count from going up um i know that's been going on i know it has and um there was a, another reader that did a channeling last night actually she actually confirmed basically that it had been happening so um i know but i already intuitively knew it was happening i knew they were trying to block my sub count that's why i um that i chose the option on here not to display my sub count um, because I knew it was happening and I knew they were doing it. Um, and I know for me who was probably doing it. And no, I don't think it's my family. Just to let you know, um, person, you're a masculine energy and you have Scorpio in your chart. And no, I don't think it was my family. And no, I don't think it was my friends. I don't have any friends. So it couldn't be any of my friends because I don't have any friends. And no, I don't think it was my family. I know it was you. Just saying. Um, and you probably recruited a hell of a lot of people to help you. But I have persevered and overcome. 
and my, my channel's still going whether you wanted to go or not. So, you know, you can get mad and glad in, or not mad and glad in your freaking undies or commando or whatever boxers, or whatever the hell you wear. I don't know. But um, I don't know why you feel the need to come after my ass. Just saying, just saying, Scorpio. Scorpio, dude. You have Scorpio in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, midhaven, or Jupiter. And yes, I'm calling you out on my channel. I didn't say your name, but you know who you are. Okay, so anyways. So, um, okay, so Libra Feminine, 40 and above. Apparently, we're pulling in a Libra Fem, 40 and above, very strong in here. Now, these two Libra Fems, the ones with the the one with the dark art spiritualist with these astrological videos, apparently, the business about to go down, and the one that works in the legal sector, I think those are two completely different people. I just want to point that out. Um, for the businesses about tank, I, I mean, those are two completely different sectors. So I feel that's co two completely different people in the universe. But whoever this other Libra Femme is, it may be one of these people, or it may be a different person. But I'm pulling in Libra Feminine Energy, 40 and above, very, very strong and heavy in here. Um, very strong. But however that resonates, basically, um, I heard she's about to start having severe, I heard severe mental health issues. Uh, flashbacks and memories of the past so something happened in her life to where there was some severe traumatic memories and flashbacks of the past um that's so severe and traumatic it sounds like that she's i heard drugs and alcohol already there so she either i think she drinks a lot or she's around somebody that drinks a lot and she's influenced by it or she shoots up or snorts or whatever, the, or takes prescription, abuses prescription pain pills or prescription medicine or something, or she's around somebody that is influenced with that. However that resonates. Um, I strongly feel there's probably social pressure there with people she's connected with, or she just, she's a ringleader and does it herself. Hell, I don't know. You plug it in how it resonates, but whoever this person is, whether it's one of these people, whether businesses are about to tank down, or it's a separate person, um, you have to plug it in how it resonates. Heard she's about to start um, having such severe mental health issues because of flashbacks and um, memories of the past of something that happened either to her or to somebody else or several other people that they might cause possible self-harm. So, um, and I heard drugs and alcohol are there. So I think she probably drinks. She might drink a lot, possibly. She might be an alcoholic for all I know. I think she's a drug user or she's around drug users. And um, to the point, she obviously has mental health issues. I'll tell you that. She wants to self-harm herself. Now, um, so you plug it in how that resonates, but it's something that's triggering some kind of traumatic flashbacks and memories of the past that's i don't know if that's promoting the alcohol use the drug use or the self-harm or one or all those things you plug it in how it resonates but it's a libra feminine in the universe they could have libra in their sun moon rising venus north node ben haven or jupiter charge you plug it in how it resonates i heard many more negative series of chain events were going to occur for her too after that so i don't know what those are i don't know let me see if I hear anything else. Oh, my God. These people try to cause severe stress on you, but it's about to boomerang back on them in a huge way. But they did it to themselves. You didn't. Oh, my God. Wow, this is so strong. Yeah, I don't feel it's you. I mean, according to the spirit messages, this is not you, you guys. If this resonates with you, it's not you. It's somebody you're connected with or has been connected with. Um, however this resonates, it's, wow, my God. Um, but I heard they call try to cause severe stress on you. So they were a huge freaking karmic energy in your life, man. The karmics are anybody. It could be anybody. Karmics can be anybody. Past lover, past family, past friend, uh, past coworker, anybody. Anybody that basically wants to block your success and fame and career and money 
and love opportunities and uh, health and wealth and family and things like that, basically. Um, but I heard they call, try to call severe stress on you, but it's about to boom, boomerang back on them energetically. So I think that's the the PTSD type flashbacks and memories of this Libra fam 40 and above. Um, and the business is tanking down over here, motor vehicle accidents, and a I heard a huge investigation, I think, with the insurance company, at least in one of those situations. It might be police for some, because I heard drugs and alcohol are going to be involved in these freaking motor vehicle accidents. So, I mean, you plug it in how it resonates, man. This is crazy. This is crazy. Let me see if I hear anything else. And in particular, Libra Feminine, 35 and above, is about to realize one of their children, family members, is about to be diagnosed with a very severe mental health condition. It's going to make them heartbroken. Intuitively, they know it's heavy karma from the past. Oh my God, what the crap? Oh my God. Oh, I think I'm done after this, man. I'm going to bed. This, I, I, I got to turn the TV off because this is, woo. You plug it in, how it resonates. This is terrible. Um, so this might be somebody you're connected to. Um, I, I heard in this one, it's a Libra Feminine, a lot of Libra Fem energy in here, a lot. A lot of Libra Fem energy. Um, Libra Femme 35 and above, I heard with that one. So whoever this person is, they are 35 or above. Um, they have Libra in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Thumb, and Hammer, Jupiter. But I heard one of their family, children, family members. So I don't think it's their child. I think it's a um, family member connected to them in some shape, form, or fashion. It's a child. And this is really terrible. It's terrible. Um, but I heard their family member child is about to be diagnosed, I heard, with a very severe um mental health condition, um, but I heard it's going to heart make them very heartbroken, which I'm sure it will. I'm sure it will make them very heartbroken, but I also heard that they know this Libra Femme 35 and above knows that they, um, it's negative karma from the past, so I don't know if this Libra Femme 35 and above physically did something to this child or they did something to somebody else to cause the negative karma to cycle back to their um, family member child. Um, because it's not their child. It's a family member. It's a child family member of theirs. So you plug it in how it resonates. Oh, my goodness. And this child is going to have many, many, many issues coming up soon. They already have in the past. It's very severe. They've been trying to sweep it under the rug. Oh, my God. Oh, okay. So this Libra Femme 35 and above, that's the one we're doing now. Um, apparently, the, I guess the Libra Femme 35 and above and her, maybe the parents of this child and other family members have been trying to sweep this medical, um, I'm sorry, mental health condition under the rug. I think they didn't want her to be diagnosed, uh, him or her, him or her. I didn't hear if it was a masculine or femme child. I don't know. I said her, it might be a, it might be a femme energy, possibly. I said her, but I didn't hear her. So... For some, it might be a femme energy. For some, it may not be. But however that resonates, um, I think the family, including the Libra Femme 35 and above, um, yeah, 35 and above, was trying to, I think they didn't want her, um, him or her diagnosed with this mental health condition. But I heard the child's already had uh, problems in the past, and they're going to have more severe problems coming up. So... And they were trying to sweep it under the rug, meaning they did. I don't think they wanted this child diagnosed with this severe mental health condition, whatever it is. I didn't hear what it is, um, but it, it sounds like it's about to happen because there's it sounds like behavior issues there. It sounds like there's behavior issues there. 
and um it's you know it's to the point where it needs to come out basically but i heard this leaper fem 35 and above knows it's some kind of heavy negative karma from the past so whatever heavy negative karma from the past has led this to happen to this child i don't know if it was to the child or if or if she did something to somebody else this leaper fem 35 and above However, that resonates. Oh my goodness. Let me see if I hear anything else. A particular Libra feminine 30, 40, I'm sorry, not 30, 40 and above. Did not realize the severity of her actions in the past, but she is starting to have a huge wake-up call now. She will probably report a Pisces feminine very soon. It may be effective, but it may not. Because people do not trust her anymore. Oh my God. So you plug it in how it resonates. We are pulling in a Libra Fem 40 and above so strong. So you plug it in how it resonates. It would probably have to be somebody else of reputable reputation to report this now. This Libra Feminine 40 and above needs to know this. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Um, maybe she watches. Maybe this Libra Fem 40 and above watches. Or maybe somebody connected to this Libra Fem 40 and above watches. I don't know. You plug it in how it resonates. But... Another Libra Fem 40 and above. It might be one of these people. It might be another person. You plug it in how it resonates. But she did something horrible to, it sounds like, to somebody else in the past. Um, but it involves a water sign. I'm not a water sign. A Pisces Fem. Um, I heard she's going to well, probably, re she realizes what she did now was horrible in the past. Why she didn't realize it in the past, I don't know. Because, you know, everybody knows right from wrong. Just saying. Um, I'm sure she did, but she didn't want to tell the truth. I mean, apparently this person has a real, real bad problem with lying. Just saying, just saying. Whoever the hell this person is. I mean, severe liar. Severe. Okay, I just heard severe liar. Okay, so that's confirmation from spirit. So she's a severe liar. So she's a severe liar and she, um, I heard she's probably going to report now a Pisces feminine. But it probably won't work. Because people don't believe her now. They don't believe her now because she lied so bad in the past. She sounds like it. I heard a huge liar from spirit. So she's a huge liar. She's a manipulator. And she manipulated some kind of huge situation in the past that it sounds like benefited a Pisces femme. But she shouldn't have done what she did. She shouldn't have lied. She shouldn't have lied, man. Um, I heard it, somebody else, somebody else of reputable, um, reputation basically will probably will probably have to end up reporting whatever in the world she wants to report because people aren't going to believe her now because she's lied so bad in the past so you plug it in however that resonates that that resonates for you it's a very highly manipulative and lie a huge ass liar libra feminine 40 and above they could have libra in their sun moon rising venus will throw me name and jupiter apparently their reputation is tainted to the ground um it sounds like in the community where this pisces lives and or or other it sounds like it ain't just the Pisces it's many other people that this is affected but now she wants to report of Pisces but she's a huge liar and a manipulator and people know this so I can see why her report probably wouldn't be very upstanding when she's a huge liar and manipulator and everybody knows that so um you plug it in how it resonates let me see if I hear anything else Okay, I didn't. I didn't. All right, Lord, I'm about to go to bed. Back to bed. I love my sleep. Everybody knows that. I sleep like a baby. All right, I love you guys. Everybody have a wonderful night. And um, I just want to disclaimer. I don't, according to the channelings, I don't think this is you guys. 
Um, I do have some heavy trolls on my page. So maybe for some of this, this is some of the heavy troll energy. Scorpio, masculine, just saying, just saying, trying to block my shit. I know about you, buddy. I know. Don't think I don't know. I fucking know. Just saying, just saying. Just, you know, people have tact. But I am publicly saying it now. Because I, I do know. But I have got my sub count up. Whether you didn't think you really were trying really hard for a really fucking long time trying to block that shit. I know you were. But I have got it up. You know I have. All right. I love you guys. Everybody have a wonderful night. And namaste.